Hello and welcome to Winnell's Guide to Soloing Lothib in Nax 25 as a hunter. So basically this fight is for the most part pretty much just a tank and spank fight. Um, there are a few abilities and stuff you got you want to be aware of. Um, one is occasionally he'll make it so that you pretty much can't heal your pet. So you do want to make sure you get men pets rolling for whenever that debuff wears off of your pet. Um, the other thing you want to do is try to kill those spores that spawn and kind of wander around. You want to kill them near you so that you can get a buff that will make it so that your abilities don't generate threat um, for two minutes in addition to doing increased crit damage. So it'll basically buff your damage while preventing you from gaining a bunch of threat, which is pretty nice. Um, so just go ahead and kill those whenever they wander over to you. But yeah, pretty much other than that, it's just a tank and spank fight. Um, make sure whenever that little debuff on your pet wears off, see it just wore off on my pet right there, that you get men pets rolling, which I actually didn't do, but... <laughs> you don't keep men pits rolling throughout the fight then your pit will never get healed and he'll be like oh no but that's pretty much all there is to this fight just um kill the spores next to you they'll provide you a damage buff in addition to making your threat gen almost nothing and try to keep men pet up whenever uh, that debuff wears off on your pet. Otherwise, just try and do as much damage as possible. And if you want the achievement for this guy basically what you have to do for the achievement is don't kill any of those spores so if you want to make sure you don't kill any of the spores make sure you turn off your pets AOE abilities um, don't use I wouldn't risk using Dire Beast Dire Beast should only attack the boss but I wouldn't risk having Dire Beast um, just in case don't use glaive tossed. Um, don't use multi shot. Just be careful about where you shoot. <laughs> so as long as you make sure you don't kill any of the spores, so no AOE type abilities or anything like that, um, you should be good to go. Turn off your pet's AOE. But that's only if you want the achievement. Alright, so hopefully you found this guide helpful, and thanks for watching.